Hello guys, Softoni here. First, like always, I want to thank you for watching this uh, video tutorial and in today's uh, lesson uh, we're going to create realistic rainfall here in After Effects without using any uh, third-party plugins. Uh, and uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button and turn on uh, the bell icon so you can always get notified whenever I post a new clip. All right, let's see what we can do today. Here we are again in After Effects and today I will be showing you two ways on how to create this uh, awesome rain effect. Uh, so let's get started and first like always let's create a new composition. Hit Ctrl plus N on your keyboard or hit this little icon here and we will name it Rain Rainfall. Okay, with 1920 height uh, uh, 1080 30 frames per second duration 10 second long and hit ok all right uh, i already have here footage from pexels.com and i will drag and drop this uh, uh, footage in our timeline so we can get started with our tutori tutorial maybe this uh, me uh, media 03 and first effect that we're going to use and first way to create a rainfall is uh, uh, to uh, right click and then create uh, a new adjustment layer we will name it rain and find here and effects and preset if you can't find this effects uh, and preset go window and then uh, find here effects and preset uh, then type here cc rainfall okay as you can see we already have here uh, sort of realistic animation uh, rain animation and we will make here a few adjustments uh, this first parameter is how many drops will be in our scene maybe around uh, 1200 to lower this a uh, little bit something like this for size maybe around 2.5 something around here and for wind we will do va variation maybe around maybe around 105 uh, 1400 something like this and as you can see we already here uh, have here this awesome uh, rain effect also you can uh, lower down or uh, up your opacity maybe to go around 50 and when we hit zero we're getting this really cool animation also what you can do, you can uh, hit T on your keyboard to lower here opacity on our solid layer, but it complet completely depends on you. Also what you can do is to duplicate this layer and choose blending mode, maybe overlay to, uh, to have something like this, to have a, a slightly different scene. All right, guys, uh, this was uh, first uh, part of this tutorial this was uh, um, first day how to create this uh, rainfall and for second one we will also create a new composition uh, I will name it uh, rainfall 02 also 1920 by 1080 and duration 10 seconds long hit ok and for this uh, second one we will drag and drop this maybe media 04 media 04 of course you will import your own footage and uh, next thing what we're gonna do is to uh, go here and then right click uh, to create a new solid layer we will also name it rainfall 02 then hit ok and for this uh, particular uh, for this particular part of tu uh, tutorial we will choose here uh, our old friend from previous tutorial particle world okay and first thing uh, what we're gonna do is to open this uh, particle tab and uh, to choose this bird bird and then color uh, that color to white okay you can also lower opacity up to maybe around 25 something like this 
and now we will go here in uh, bird trade to choose maybe around uh, three longevity maybe around two something like this also we will open this producer tab for uh, position for position y we will do maybe around um, minus 30 to move up our particles when we hit zero now we have something like this okay for this uh, radius x we will do maybe 0 0.800 something like this okay uh, now uh, we will go here in physics tab and for velocity choose zero and gravity maybe around 0 0.8 150 just to see now how uh, it will look like here also uh, choose this solid layer uh, go to around four seconds move it to the left just uh, to see our all particles here in our scene expand it to here and then when we hit zero we have something like this also next thing what we're gonna do is to uh, go here in gravity vector and for uh, gravity x maybe around minus 220 and maybe uh, for this uh, gravity z around minus 350 and now when we hit zero we have something like this and next thing what we're gonna do is to hit also t on our keyboard and to lower opacity of this of those particles maybe around 30 percent also for birth rate we will do maybe 1.5 something like this and when we hit zero we have a pretty much similar uh, effect like we uh, already created with uh, cc rainfall effect all right i have shown you how to do this uh, uh, rain effect uh, with uh, those two ways it's up to you which one you will use you can combine it also if you want and that was pretty much it for today's tutorial all right guys i hope you learned something new in today's uh, video lesson uh, i want to thank you again for watching this uh, video tutorial if you haven't subscribed to my channel hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell icon so you can always get notified whenever i post a new clip if you have some comments, write me in the comment section below. Also, take a look on my channel for even more great tutorials. And until next time, stay creative and bye-bye.